Hi everyone, welcome to the episode 4 of the Coffee Basic course. I hope you went through the materials in the previous section and you have checked out your uh, current coffee knowledge and if you are comfortable with uh, the topics that we went through in the previous three episodes, we now can uh, move forward and talk about the coffee harvesting. If you're still not comfortable, I'm suggesting you just pause this video and uh, to go through the first three episodes again to make sure that you fully understa understood the basics that we spoke about a coffee plant and the coffee species and the differences between the coffee species. In this episode, we will talk about um, coffee harvesting. Um, there are three different ways to harvest the coffee from the um, coffee plants. So coffee har harvesting is the picking the cherries from the coffee cherries from the coffee plant and uh, can be done in the three different ways. Can be done by manual picking, can be done by striping and can be done mechanically. So let's uh, discuss all of those three uh, different approaches separately. So picking, as the name suggests, is uh, done manually by picking the only ripe cherries from the tree. It's done in the several rounds since coffee cherries are ripening in the different uh, in different times, so they're not all ripening at the same time. So the coffee plant can be all the cherries can be picked out uh, at, in one day. They're ripening slowly, day by day. So pickers are coming every day and they are uh, picking the only, only the ripe uh, ripe cherries. Which this uh, picking method, harvesting method, is uh, making the uh, more expensive, more laborious, but as well very, uh, very uniform than the highest quality of the all three method, methods of uh, harvesting. Usually picking uh, harvesting method is the most associated with the specialty coffee. Second one, what we have is the, uh, is the striping. Uh, striping is done as well by the people, by the pickers, but uh, in a little bit different manner. So basically, uh, pickers are coming and uh, striping a full branch from the from the end to towards to the from the beginning towards to the end. Uh, they are striping it and pulling together with uh, all cherries and leaves and some branches and uh, everything together. So in that way, this type of uh, harvest is uh, a bit faster. It's uh, less laborious and it's uh, less uniform, unfortunately, because after this uh, type of harvesting, sorting process is much more complex, complex to get out only, only ripe cherries and proper cherries and to remove branches and leaves. Third method is mechanical method. As the name suggests, this is done by machine and it's a bit fast, it's a non laborious so you just need a machine driver so machine works uh, on the way that goes over the plants with the vertical brushes which are shaking the cherries out uh, and uh, down to the bottom of the machine where they are later on gathered this is very fast the harvesting method less laborious and uh, less uniform as well when it comes to the mechanical Mechanical striping, uh, it's good to mention, and can be done only in the flat areas, which is uh, and flat farms, which is the most logical uh, option. It's not logical that machine goes over the hills and do the do the that type of harvesting. So those are those are the three harvesting methods, uh, and uh, three methods actually how the cherries can be picked out from the coffee plant. So what's left now is to talk about processing and that will come in the next episode. See you there.